Okay, guys, this is round two at the sprayer. Can I inter introduce you? Hi. August. Hi. This is August. He's going to walk us around this sprayer here real quick. This is the new 1,600-gallon uh, sprayer from Bent. This is what, how long a boom is this, August? Uh, that is a 36-meter boom. 36-meter boom. I think in our translation, that's like 130, 130, 130? Something like that, okay. I think it is. 132, maybe, feet? Have a look. Okay. <laughs> we gotta get this figured out. We gotta do the quick calculation on this. So, 36 meters, we got uh, 180 foot. 100, oh, it's 120. It's a 120 foot boom. Yeah. Okay, that's what it is. Okay, we got a 120 foot boom on here. Can you get a wider boom, I guess, or is this the same? That is the widest boom at the moment. Okay. Um, we go from 24 meters up to 36 meter boom. Okay. Okay. So, we'll start with the tires. So, you got the 50 inch tires on here, you got the IF. Can we can we lower the pressure in this to put a little put a little squat in the tire to make yes, it we can. Not make it a little but you can just adjust the, the tire okay pressure. okay and now I, as everyone sees there's a huge gap in here so the sprayer's actually lifted as far as it would go is that right August yes and uh, at this speed it's uh, limited to 20 kilometers yes at, at this height I should say at this height and when you go to the lower heights you're, you can go 40 kilometers absolutely right okay. Okay, now, how can I adjust that height? Can I do that from in the cab? You do this always from the cab. It's 100% uh, hydraulics, and it's, uh, you can either choose the higher or lower position of the machine. Okay, okay. Now, um, how, how many liters is your uh, rinse tank? Uh, we've got 500 liters in the rinse tank. Okay, and it's split right there? Exactly. And it kind of trails down into here? Yes. Okay. Now, I see I've got some, are those, is that air, or what do we have here, We've August? We've got one air pipe and one uh, water pipe. Okay. So you can have always clean water the rear of the machine okay. to clean your boom out. Interesting. Or you have some, uh, yeah, pressure air to clean the tips. Okay. And then what do we got here? Is that the overflow for the tank? That is not the overflow. This is just a transport um, installation for a pipe. Transport? You, you see the end of the pipe over there? Goes up to the front of the tank. This is just for transportation. Then you take it off. Oh, and you go to your hydro oh, so this is part of the sprayer. So you can take this off. Yes. Exactly. So is there a, is there a spot? So back in North America, we typically have like a something like that where we just have it. We can just quick couple on. We don't have to have that big long hose. Yeah. Is that possible? Can we load here? Yes, it's just for transportation. So it's it's loose over there. Oh, it's loose. Okay. Okay. So just it's, pop it's it off. Kind of okay. Machine. I didn't understand you then. Take it off. Put it on here and then okay. It on. Okay. I didn't understand you. Okay. And now this has this is the chem inductor. Exactly. And can we see the chem inductor brought down? Yeah. I have to get on my tippy toes here. So this is just for the rinse. All three of these are rinse. Yeah. You got a real flush like a toilet yep. inside. Yeah. Can fill it up to six liters. Okay. And then we have the suction, big. Um, suction power from 200 liters per minute. Of 200 liters per minute suction power. And this is the rinse or jugs. Yep. This is a very deep chem inductor. Oh, and then they got a rinse right here too for when you can close it, eh? Exactly. Okay. And then we've got here our housing for the filter. So this is the That's filter. the. Is this the main filter, the, the number yeah. one filter? That is the number one filter. This is number two. Is there more filter. filters? There's another suction filter okay. which is underneath. Okay. So this is the last filter before the actual liquid goes into goes the into tank. The boom. Yeah. Goes into the boom. So if I'm gonna, so I'm loading in here. I throw some, get some dirt and something in here. Yeah. Where's what filter am I gonna go to first? This one. You go to from clean? here first to the suction filter. Which suction is filter underneath. underneath. Here, okay. And then it goes into the tank and from the tank through the pressure filter. Okay. Into it's pressure the filter. Boom. Got it. And then. Um, what do we have up here for a keypad? This is our control panel for the whole sprayer. So okay. we've got the suction side here and the pressure side here. Okay. So the liquid always comes from this area, goes through the pump uh, into the pressure area. So okay. through the boom, back into the tank, into the cleaning system, or overloading to another tank. So to another tank? Or something else. Okay. So you suck in your water from this side, yep. and you can overload it on this side. Oh. Basically, you can also use this as a as big stationary pump. Yeah, okay, so, so you, you can, can suck in water here and at the same time you pressure it out from this side. Interesting, interesting, all right. And what do we have here? So this is then the, we just spoke about the um, water hose at the back yes. of the machine. Oh, that, just for activation that applies the pressure, okay. Exactly. Yeah. Okay, and then the other red valve here? 
Yeah, this is done for the adapter. Oh, here, so got you it. Can, um, you can choose between different modes. So this is the flushing system at the oh, bottom. Oh, okay. This is the cleaning system up here. And this down here, there's a little nozzle at the elbow. So down here for, um, for example, like uh, fertilizer or something okay. that you put in from back here. So there's a little nozzle in here to clean out the pipe. Always. Okay. So if I had granular, chemical or granular, granular that, that would clean the granular out of there. Exactly. Awesome, man. That granular hangs up and everywhere. You can, then, you can mix it up. So if you put, the, if you put it in between, you have yep. both activated. Awesome. Yeah. Okay. And then, can I, like I can adjust all my RPMs. I can turn the pump on and off from here, right? Exactly. Just make it just, just summarizing. But um, before you start here, you can also do this from the cap. Oh, you can. So you adjust everything from the cab, from the cab. Then yep. you just walk out, put on your hose, and you start the pump, and everything is already set up. Awesome. And then this one, this one here, is for the clean water. Clean water. So this needs to be filled always with an external pump. And that goes into that 500 liter tank. That goes in that 500 liter okay. tank. So, so the small. clean water is never in touch with the pump or okay. with the system where chemicals go through. Okay. Okay. All right. Huh. So then I just close this thing up and you just lift it up. When you look inside here, you see our hydraulics? Yes, so this is the this is the main pump of the sprayer. This we've is the got, We've got two pumps. Okay. We've got two hydraulic pumps. One is for driving and adjusting the boom. Okay. And the other one is only for the pump. That the means, product pump of the sprayer. Exactly. Got that it. means if you have a lot of working on the boom or yeah. something. It won't draw it down. Exactly. Got so it. You will always have the right rounds per minute of the pump that you need. Okay. And at the far end, you see the end of the engine. So the power the to the back hydraulics goes straight from the engine into here. So that the engine and pump actually sit horizontally. Exactly. So the engine is right underneath here onto the other side, which we'll go to we in a second. We uh, recently talked about weight distribution, and you see the highest weight of the machine, which is the, the engine, is located underneath. Okay. Together with the hydraulics, it gives you really um, equal distribution. Okay. And now when this thing is loaded, August, just to summarize again what we were talking about prior, um, loaded, booms in, booms out, the weight distribution is? 50-50%. Doesn't matter That's whether you're empty, you're full, your booms are back, okay? Yeah. Okay. That's very interesting. And we can't get in it, guys, because it doesn't... Uh... Why can't we get in again, August? Because it's just too high. It's too high for the German standards for safety regulation reasons only. But... Uh, this August is just to put our fresh water in, right? Yes, fresh water, soap, and then underneath here Ooh. is a compartment where you put in secret your, compartment. Um, your cans that you can travel with you. Okay. And then you see the cab, the Aquavision cab, which is um, the largest cab on the market and also the most quiet one. Okay. Got full controls on your right hand side. Is that the? Uh, that looks like oh, oh no, it's different from the Fen combine. Eh? It's a little different. It is the same joystick. It's the same the joystick combine, as the just combine, different just different. Okay. Uh, you've got two screens, yeah. and you've got an additional electronic and hydraulic valve. Okay. For example, a slug pellet spreader or something else that you want to attach to the machine. Okay. okay. Still got our cooler in there, I see. Yes, cooling and heating. Can you get leather seat? Can you get the Fent leather seat, like what's in the tractors? Um, no. No, no leather seat. Okay. At the moment. Okay. Now this is all plastic. Not plastic. Pretty, pretty easy to clean. And then, so really nothing to hang us up. It's all flat. And now we can obviously widen. What? How wide can we go? How now wide can we spread? To say in, in Europe, it's from uh, one meter eighty to two twenty-five meters. So two, two point two five meters wide. Uh, we're we're going to get the math out here right away, guys. We figure this out. Interesting. So that goes to 7.3 foot. About seven and a half, eight feet. Okay. Give or take. Okay. Now on this side, what's that? What's that little thing? That's just uh, you take them out and you put that behind the wheels. Oh, okay. Those are those blocks. Now this is our fuel tank. This is the fuel tank with the 350 liters. 350 liters. The DEF, yeah. The DEF one with uh, 80 liters. Okay, 80 liter DEF. Included into the, into the bumper. Okay. Uh, this is another compartment for your toolbox. Something Storage, for toolbox. Your that you need. Then uh, behind this, there's the engine compartment. That's the engine compartment. 
And what engine's in there again, August? It's in a six-cylinder Echo Power engine. Six-cylinder. 306 horses. All right, six-cylinder engine, Echo powered engine. Okay. Um, yeah, far away from the cab, so really, really quiet. The driver is not um, yeah, in touch with vibrations or anything, so he's awesome. Very, very. very now, very what's comfortable. what's the warranty on this machine? The warranty. Um, uh, standard warranty you can extend your uh, warranty program up to eight years eight years yeah. well, you, you can extend it you to can eight, years. It your eight years or, or eight thousand hours on the end. so you can eight years or eight thousand hours that is unbelievable that's awesome okay well oh what do we have for um nozzle control like what's our what's our nozzle control it's mounted here we've got uh, we call it quad got, select yeah i see that so that means you can um, control four nozzles at the same time and you can mix them up so you can have either the red one and the blue one and the purple one and yep. the other red one all together or in a different uh, so so can two spray like this at the same time yes and can you you can't run all four though at the same yes, time? Yes, you can. You can run all four. Yes. So you can have two and two running at the same time. Yes. Wow. They don't pulse though. They don't pulse. No. Nope, no they don't pulse. pulse. At all. Is there line. is there an LED light up there? I can't tell. We've got LED lights uh, actually at the boom, so we have there's no single nozzle light. Okay, no single nozzle. It's just a, a just boom, boom lightning. Okay. Um, the lights are mounted. Uh, behind the boom so that no dust and no uh, dirt can touch them. Okay. And um, yeah, really bright LED lights. Awesome. Well, I think that's all the questions I have you have for you for right now. I can't think, I don't think I'm forgetting anything. All right. Well, thank you, August. You're welcome. It was a pleasure. You have yourself a good one. Have the rest of the day. Thank you.